Good afternoon, Joyce. It's good being with you this afternoon. I just wanted to stop and take a moment and talk a little bit about how you felt when you first started and how you're doing today, six weeks later. So if you wouldn't mind sharing with us what was going on with you six weeks ago and, and uh, how do you feel today? Well, today I feel probably, I'd say, at least 50% better than I did when I started. Well, that's exciting. And um, when I started coming to see you, I was experiencing extreme pain in the evening trying to sleep. Even though I had pain during the day, I'm pretty busy, so I didn't notice it as much. But when I laid down at night, I had a lot of pain and cramping in my feet. So it was worse at night when you were trying to sleep, inter interrupting your sleep? Yes. Well, that's frustrating, isn't it? It's very frustrating. And are you sleeping better today? Um, I have been, uh, plus I have, I purchased like every ointment and cream and neuropathy for neuropathy and pain that they have on the market. And um, I do have one recommendation, frankincense and myrrh. That's a good one. But uh, <laughs> out of all of them, that's the only one that does provide a little relief. But I find today I haven't been using that any of them uh, Wonderful. for a while. When I started taking the nitric oxide, mm -hmm. I noticed that I got feeling in my feet. Beautiful. In my toes. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's where the main problem was. And I was even able to move them. Be before that, they were very, they were very stiff. And movement was, movement didn't necessarily hurt, but it was just, I wasn't able to just wiggle them. And now I can do can't pick up anything with my toes, but I can certainly <laughs> wiggle them. How, how long were you suffering with the neuropathy prior to coming in? How long did you have it for? Well, I injured my back in 2003. I herniated two discs. Mm -hmm. And it, I didn't have the neuropathy initially. It was just the back pain. But it, it developed probably over like a four or five year period where I first noticed like a bit of numbing in my toes. Mm -hmm. And then gradually that increased and then it became a burning, numbing, burning uh, pressure. It felt like my toes were going to explode. So this, this was all occurring over a four or five year time frame. Yeah, and that was from 2003 was, was the injury. Mm -hmm. And so say like three or four years later um, and I've tried other therapies. You tried other things, they failed you, but here we are six weeks into your program at Pinnacle Pain Management and you're 50% better. That's right. exciting. Right. All right, well thank you so much for sharing that story and glad you're doing so well.